If you or someone you know is on Medicare, there are some important information things that you need to know. The new Medicare cards are coming in the mail and it will come with a new ID. KRX 5 News Director Jeff Roth explains it's all aimed at battling fraud. Have you heard the latest? Everyone with Medicare is getting a new card. If you haven't heard, listen up. If you have Medicare, there is an important envelope that will soon be showing up in your mailbox. The federal government is issuing new Medicare cards with new numbers on them in an effort to battle Medicare fraud. More than half a million Medicare recipients in Colorado will be getting the new cards in the mail by the end of October. We spoke with Regional Medicare Administrator Jeff Hinson via Skype from Denver about the change. Uh, we replaced the card that most social security underbased with a unique randomly generated alphanumeric number which actually protects the beneficiary's identity stops from identity theft. Hinson says that with a unique number it's easier to replace a card with a new number if your identity is stolen and the number is harder to steal than a social security number. And since scammers are always trying to scam, if someone calls you to ask questions about your new card, ignore it. The government is mailing the card to you, and no one from Medicare will call you about it. What should you do with your old card? Well, uh, once they get the card, they should destroy their old Medicare card. Securely destroy it, shred it. The new card is active, but then you get it, and it's ready to go. Be on the lookout for that envelope over the next couple of weeks, and show the new card with the new number to your health care providers after you receive it. First on the Western Slope, I'm Jeff Roth. KREX 5 News. If you want to check out the status of your new card and when you can expect to get it in the mail, go to medicare.gov backslash new card.